Are you obsessed with Mama Moo? Are you curious to see their living arrangements? If so, you just landed on the right video. Hello everyone, and welcome back to Starstruck, where you'll get an inside look at all your favorite K-pop groups' living arrangements. But before we get started, smash that red subscribe button. Mamamoo is a popular K-pop girl band formed by RBW Entertainment in 2014. There are currently four members in the group, including Solar, Moongyo, Huyin, and Hwasa. The group emerged on the music scene on June 18, 2014, with the release of their single, Mr. Ambiguous, from their first extended play, Hello!, and the song was also ranked one of the best debut songs of the year by critics. Group's third EP, Pink Funky, and lead single, Um Oh Ah Ye, proved to be a breakthrough as it was an instant hit and became the group's first top three single on Gown Chart. Some of the most popular songs from Mamamoo include Hip, Egotistic, Dinja, and Go Go Bebe. Following the K-pop tradition of living together during their early years, Mamamoo members also used to share a tiny rooftop apartment at the beginning of their career. But now, as they are in the industry for more than seven years, the girls have made enough money to afford their separate living spaces. According to Solar's YouTube channel, Solacito, she lives alone in her apartment in Seoul, but that's not the only property she owns. Solar has been recently taking a lot of interest in real estate, and as per different reports, she has purchased a super expensive four-story building in the Sinchon district of South Korea. Seems like she has come a long way from sharing an apartment with other members to gradually venturing into the real estate business. Talking about the other members, Hwasa has recently moved to her new 2.3 million US dollar super luxurious home. Previously, she lived in an apartment, but had to shift due to the poor security conditions in the area. Her new villa does not just offer enough space, but its decor also impressed the fans with its modern yet minimalistic style. The apartment has a quite simplistic vibe with plenty of wood and neutral colors. Her bedroom is quite spacious and features a comfortable bed, a tall plant to add freshness, and thick curtains to block the sunlight during the day. During an episode of I Live Alone, Huasa gave a peek into her villa. Other than her comfy bedroom, there is an airy living area thanks to the giant floor-to-ceiling windows. The open-plan living room is joined by the stylish kitchen, which features beautiful wooden cabinets. It is equipped with all the modern facilities, including a built-in refrigerator and oven, as well as dark granite counters, which transition into a desk. There is also a balcony extension from the kitchen living space. Although it's not as spacious, but it offers enough space where Hwasa can enjoy her evening coffee. You can also find plenty of cute pictures with Mama Moo members scattered all over the place. Wien and Moonbull also live separately in their apartments, but Wien is often seen spending a lot of time at Moonbyul's place, and fans often think they live together, but that's not true as she owns a separate apartment. The group has garnered huge success in the past seven to eight years and has stayed super close to each other, but the situation might be on the verge of a change now. The members Solar, Moonbyul, and Hwasa have renewed their contracts with the parent company RBW, but Huyen has plans to say goodbye to RBW to start her solo ventures. She will be participating in a few group activities by the end of 2023, but that can be the end of her time with Mamamoo. What do you guys think about this upcoming change in the group? Will it cause the group to disband? Share your views in the comment section. Bye for now, and thanks for watching.